now a headache for boaters before the summer season even begins. The Folsom Lake Marina is already about to close. Here's the problem. Water is draining out of Folsom Lake even faster than last year. And many boaters want to know why. KCRA 3's Richard Sharp is live with where all the water is going. Richard? If from Folsom Lake, the water comes into Lake Natoma through Nimbus Dam and into the American River. The Bureau of Reclamation says they've had to increase those flows because of a problem downstream. It's a quick measurement. Usually I count the steps coming down. <laughs> How many more steps it takes to get to the boat docks at Folsom Lake Marina as the lake level recedes? A week ago to the week before that, it went down about one step. Soon, all the steps will be out of water. Before that, all the boats and the slips have to be pulled out of the water. The last day is June 14th, just as the boating season heats up. We normally pull out uh, on a good year in November. Uh, last year? Last year, I didn't put my boat in at all. This year, your boat's in? Yes. Yeah. Not for long? Not for long. Got to pull it out in two weeks. This summer, the water in Folsom Lake is not expected to last as long as it did last year. While it is at about the same level, perhaps, that it was at this time last year, last year there was snowpack, and this year there isn't. The flows from Folsom Dam were increased today because of what's happening in the delta. The wind and tides are pushing more seawater up into the delta. To push back, the Sacramento River needs more water. And that water is coming from Folsom Lake. We're going to start to really see the effects of the fourth year of the drought. Back at the marina, boaters pay up to $1,300 a year for boat slips that they will barely get to use this summer. Well, it is what nature does to us. I mean, it is what it is. Now, the boats have to be removed from the slips at Folsom Marina, but that doesn't mean there isn't boating on the lake even after that. It just means they will not, people who have boats in those slips will not be able to use them because those slips will be parked on mud pretty soon. Live along the American River, Richard Sharp, KCRA 3 News.